turn on. Uh, you get to go first, sir. Hey, I know these cards. I play them in my deck. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you up? You you gotta be kidding me. No, I'm I'm really not. This is really what I play in my deck. I I just have to show people this so that people can solve. See. I won't look. I'm peeking. Um, could you have a worse starting hand in the world? Oh uh, yeah, you could. I I did the other day. Four times in a row against Garrison. There's absolutely nothing playable here unless he were going first. <laughs> so you want me to go first? Is what you're saying? You can go first. All right. <laughs> I'll draw. Uh, I also have a terrible hand. <laughs> Uh, but at least it's a hand I can do something with, you know, I can I can be forced to work. So I'll go Hazy Pillar, Normal Summon my Hazy Flame Treebus, and one face down will end my turn. So he's not going to get halved, because I got the pillar. Yeah. So. You know what? That so, is, That's about 80 times better than what I have. <laughs> it, well, maybe you can make a play now. You know, I've got like that Cyber Dragon you need to drop. Uh, well, let's see. Um, this deck is just awesome. I mean, well, it's actually really cool because uh, Cameron, Lion Hunter, and I actually both came up with this idea separately. And then we kind of like realized we were both having the same idea, and so now we're working out together. Yeah, this is oh, too damn good. Or hazy flames. Hazy, hazy kings. Oh, Combining hazy. the hazies with the kings. We were both like, we both kind of had the same idea at the same time, and I'm actually doing that online right now. Yeah, see, it's it's too good. It's too good not to, not to try. I I started doing that just like two days ago. So uh, yes. Uh, very good. I, I, I am going to dominantly do it, so if anyone can give me a jump start on it, <laughs> I'm totally in for it. I, I'll, you can know, all the problems I got laying around. Like or something, but I am going to do a foolish burial. Negate. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Wait, I was going, no, what are you negating with? <laughs> <laughs> I know his effect, and he can't. It he still works. I used to do, no, I, 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 for a long time there, I was playing a Stardust Assault Mode deck. Oh yeah, and so I would. I would just tribute my starters and negate things like every turn, and so it got to the point where like I'd win the first duel, I'd be in a tournament and go to duel two, and my opponent, you know, they play their first card on their first turn, and I just go negate, and they go crap, and they put it in the graveyard, not even realizing I don't have anything on the field, and then I kind of laugh at them. Well, no, you get your card effect. But... Let me negate with my balls. That guy. The correct answer is value. Dropping a value. Dropping a value. Um, wasn't the actually? I don't even know if you're playing value in that build. I don't think so. But now that you started making me think about value, Dude, I, started... I love value. The the Vayu the Vayu Turbo build is the only kind of Blackwing that I've ever had any kind of success running. I'm not a Blackwing player. Like I'll I'll say flat out I'm not good at Blackwings. You know it does good when you're right there. So. Whoa! What the heck are you doing upside down? Elf and the Raven. This time you want it in the grave, because the last time it was unplayed. Yeah. With only uh, 20 black wings in there, and they're not actually 20 cards, and four of them aren't black wings. And three copies of Icarus Attack in hand, too. <laughs> Icarus Attack? Three copies of Icarus Attack. Is that what I you have got? 18 copies of Icarus attack in my hand. I don't have any Icarus attack in my hand. Hmm. 
That will come in later. Um, MST. No, it won't. <laughs> well. A lot of tough decisions for Cameron I hear on this first turn. <laughs> hmm. How about I do Fisher? Sounds fantastic. Uh, that's going to activate Cerebrus Effect. Let me search out a Hazy card from my deck and add it to my hand. And the one I'm going to choose is... Where are you? Crazy time. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Man. Why do I keep getting that card and it still doesn't do me any good? One of these days I'm gonna... Bang! Pow! Straight to the moon! One of these days I'm gonna have to try to figure out exactly how to get that finalized better. Uh, I'm gonna put this card face down. And... If it, manages, if it manages to survive, <laughs> it'll be awesome. Your turn. Okay. When you when you have a really sucky deck situation, it uh, you find yourself so in Periton? with the pillar. Yep. Effect. What's his effect? Uh, he's the one that I sent him and a fire monster from my hand to the graveyard to special summon two hazies from my deck. I'm um, sorry, you cannot target my monster. Oh, that's because he's unaffected by target. Yeah. I was trying to remember which one actually does that, but I think they all do. All that. the hazies, all the hazies do that. You can target the Fire Kings, but you can't target the Hazies. Shows me how uh, how connected I am with them right now. <laughs> so, I'm going to send him in that one. And special summon... Burn, burn, burn. I can't wait until I play with these guys. And then after we shuffle up... Shuffle up, I guess. Gonna go ahead and activate the effect of the Sphinx. Spell. Ooh, I got it right. It's not the spell I wanted to lose, though. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, we'll go ahead and bring back Cerebrus. Um. Battle phase. Cerebrus attack. Damage step. One of the Phantom Beast on Cerberus. So now Which when I just when I I'll increase my attack by eight hundred, and then when I destroy it, I get to draw a card. Wow. And Is then, that an equip card now? Yes, it does count as an equip card now. Oh, cool. And then attack for nineteen and for two thousand. Nineteen and two thousand. And main phase two. I think I'm gonna. Hold it. Proton Strike Bouncer. Your turn. I just got that guy. He's in, good. Yeah, a 10. That 10 uh, with the, the Prophecy. Yeah. Never had that card before, but I do have him now. Yeah, like, sure. Like, I'm really going to last long enough for that card to actually work. At least you can Divine Wrath that one. Wait, I'm gonna last long enough for this effect. Oh man! <laughs> I'm Gold just gonna, start. Things are going terrible. I'm just gonna grab one card off the top of my deck and put it out of play. <laughs> I'm not even. I, I didn't even right. care what right, it was. Maybe I'll be nice and I'll let you live. Oh wow! That's different. Well, he's looking at that. I'm gonna go look at some. Next year, a version. Oh my gosh, yes. How about that one monster doubles as Plagueis Werewolf? 
I've actually thought about using plague. Here. <laughs> There's that one that one monster. I can't remember his name, but when he's on the field, he doubles as Plague's werewolf. Or plague. And zombie. gets yeah, yeah, the, the his pain effect. Panther. The pain panther. Yeah. And he and it works very well with uh, bummer. What a, that's a, that's a bummer, man. Um, I'm gonna space type in that one. Of course, you know what it is. <laughs> oh, sorry. I, no, I actually didn't even think about that. I'll just end my turn. I don't need to attack. One turn off of the. Little guy. Although that would have been game right there. That would have been game. No, it wouldn't. You'd still have a couple life points left. No, wait, yeah, it would. Because I forgot I'm equipped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm bigger than I thought I was. Well, it's only one turn down. You know what I'm going to do? Is Go nuts. I'm, I am going to put some special cards down. Uh oh. Alright, I'll draw. I don't think the ranger's gonna like this. All right, yeah, you're really not gonna like this spell. All right, I'm gonna I'm going to special summon my Goka Pyre of the Malice. When I do, whoa! Hold on, I should grab it. What the? <laughs> hey, there's a coin right there. Oh, I, I, I want one of my cool tokens, like my Gem W O token. Have you got some cool tokens? Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna special summon him. When he gets special summoned. I uh, destroy a fire monster on my side of the field, like this one. Yeah. And special summon a token. So this is gonna be my token. And I'm gonna destroy this one. So if one of the Phantom Beast also goes. Now, because he was destroyed by a car effect, I use his effect to search out a hazy from my deck to my hand. Carry time? Select one fire monster and destroy that, so you destroy him. Then I'm going to normal summon Periaton. So that's actually a level one attack. Mm-hmm. And you haven't attributed anything for this guy yet. Yeah, I did. I didn't. I thought it was destroyed. You destroyed one fire monster on your field, which took this guy away. Oh, because yeah. you oh, you're talking about the other effect. Yeah, because yeah, you can no. increase his uh, attack, so it's still 2200. Yeah. Do I want to overlay or do I want to bring one out, another one out? This goes so wonderful with number six. <laughs> Rekindling out him again. Because why the hell not, right? What were those two? So many choices. Massive quantities of choices. Um, I'm going to go with another photon strike monster just to be a dick. No, no, I already got one out. We'll go with. <laughs> we'll get 25. We'll get 25. That's fun. And that's not being a dick. That's, <laughs> no, that's me being nice. Isn't that terrible? All right, I'll set this card face down. And pass. So you get your monster. <laughs> Whoopee! <laughs> At this point, it does me very little good, but... but hey, you're, you're, you're more than welcome to summon that. <laughs> yeah, I'll still summon it. No, it doesn't. 